Hello, this is Antonio from Wartex. In this video, I will demonstrate how to create virtual meters that you can track using the Formula Composer. Energy managers and building owners work with the goal of attaining as close to 100% visibility as possible into buildings so that they can use that to model against other similar buildings. And there are some circuits that would be a waste to monitor due to the cost and because they have a constant or steady consumption that will not fluctuate. So creating virtual meters for this group of appliances or fixtures or circuits are necessary to be able to apportion total energy consumption in a building and it is a requirement of the ISO 50001 certification which provides a framework for establishing energy management best practice to help organizations to improve their energy efficiency plus make a return on investments. And as we can see on the screen, the standards enable organization to establish the systems and processes necessary to improve energy performance including energy efficiency, use and consumption. Besides the ISO 50001, other uses uh, for virtual meters may include grouping meters for department cost control, either electrical or gas or other costs. And secondly, measurements and verification. And this is to demonstrate the effectiveness of an energy efficiency project. So let me demonstrate here with the dashboard how um, the formula composer can be used to create uh, these formula meters that would uh, put together certain appliances and then use those uh, for, for a, in, a me in a measurements and verification project. So if we go to the breakdown tab and we open the organic farm and we see the, the breakdown of consumption and go to the refrigeration area, we, we, we see for example these three compressors here. So suppose that uh, uh, the energy professionals is optimizing these three compressors uh, by installing a control system and now he wants to put a, a measurements and verification project to understand the effectiveness of his installations. The way he would do, uh, first he would um, go to the formula composer and create a, a, a formula meter that put together these three compressors. So the first thing he would look for the right operator, so it's the plus, so then he would do at compressor 1 uh, plus compressor 2 um, plus compressor 3 so at compressor 3 and here are the three compressors uh, that are put together into the new formula meters and he can now navigate and go back in time, October's, he will go to the 2017 and so on and so forth. So now that we have these uh, three compressors put together uh, we can create a new point called uh, compressor compressors or food compressors. Um, we, we can associate those points in the organic farm, we can put kilowatt hour as a unit and um, uh, we can start the 1st of September for the, the 1st of January our uh, calculation 2017. Tick the box and then we can submit and as soon as we submit the system will start a background job that will that would start putting together these measurements from the 1st of January 2017. For the purpose of this um, demonstration, I've already created a, a, a formula meters called food compressors. So if we go to the MMV uh, tool, uh, the organic farm, we're going to create a new project. We call it uh, compressor optimization. Uh, optimization. The option will be the option B because it's a retrofit on the three compressors and uh, I can now create this project which brings me through to, to this MMV tool where I can define the project until, uh, until uh, the executive summary. I will jump to the baseline period where I can link my project to my new formula meter that is here, food compressors. I will link this. I will start my calculation from the 1st of January uh, 2017 until, for example, the first, the sorry, the first of uh, um, a March 2017. Let's suppose that this is my baseline. The the, the data will be uploaded uh, directly or linked to this to this point. And now I can start my project and I can select my reporting, routine adjustments, and so on. So I will conclude my MMV project and I will show the savings hopefully. So I hope that uh, that was interesting. This concludes my demonstration and have a great day.